What is up everybody, it's your boy Sean24, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to make a very quick video. It's honestly a very small issue, but it is an annoyance and uh, we're just going to get right to it. So if you notice on Battle.net, there's this weird glitch going on where it'll say playing now, but you're not able to click it. There's nothing you can really do about it. You can restart Battle.net, you can like pretty much close it and uh, try to open it back like I am right now and pretty much anything you do it's just going to log in and it's still going to say playing now it's super annoying and I finally figured out how to fix it I, I kept restarting my computer but there's a better way of doing this so what you want to do is just press Control, shift and escape at the same time and then your task manager will open up. Here what you want to do is click B for Battle.net uh, on your keyboard and then it should show up. End task. And once you've end task for that, let it close. Okay, so it's going to close. It's supposed to close. I don't know what's going on right now. Okay, sir. Can you please close? There we go. Okay, so now it's closed. So this should technically close oh wait one more spot all right there we go okay now that we figured that out you want to close all of the battle nets that you see on task manager usually i only see one i don't know why it showed like three different ones but once you close that the next thing you want to do is press the letter key on your keyboard uh oh key on your keyboard the letter you want to press the letter c on your keyboard there you go call of duty HQ, you want to end task. And once that is done, pretty sure that's about it. I don't think there's any other. Yeah, so that's about it. Once you've gone ahead and closed all of that, you can go ahead and close your task manager. You can open up Battle.net again. It should log in and it should let you click play now. And uh, that's pretty much it. I know it's a weird, annoying issue. I tried to switch my Battle.net to the beta. That really didn't do much. Um, so it's literally you have to go into Task Manager and like reset the application from the Battle.net to the Call of Duty application. Just to, just end those two tasks and then you're pretty much good to start playing again. Uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching this video and uh, I'll catch you on the next one.